2014 and 2015 have been particularly difficult for climbers attempting to go up Mount Everest. 2014 you had an avalanche, 2015 you had the earthquake. Havoc everywhere and havoc in particular for the climbers uh, that are attempting to climb the biggest mountain in the world. There's a system here that has been disrupted and backed up climbers that, that were registered for 2014, attempted 2014, were trying 2015, and then uh, the climbers from 2014 and 2015 were in turn trying for this year. Ronnie just let me know that there's a real uh, chaotic situation at the registration office for climbing. So we're gonna leave in about 10 minutes and see what's going on. Yeah, we're, um we're off to the Ministry of Tourism, and uh, they're, the, they're the guys that issue our permit. Tourist police. Just looking a little, uh, <laughs> not so, I don't know, something, there's things have changed, young man. Yes, hello. Oh, okay, yeah. How are you? I'm good. Now we are. You're waiting yeah, for me? Yeah, yes. Okay. 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 Yeah, Camp 2 can be cold. Because you're going to be you're going to be living in that suit up above um, uh, up above the ice wall for sure. Yeah. This is an important part of the registration ah, day. Just we just want to out from here as soon as possible. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think they did, did they not quite know what to do as far as yeah, the transfer? I think so. Yeah. Okay. All these things. Transferring from previous years. Mm. What percentage Another of operate. climbers this year are transfers? Um, Twenty percent. Um, ah, obviously more. 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 Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last year, 2015, as far as I remember, out of 300 climbers from 2014, 127 were last year. Were so and that was last year. Now there's a there's carry there's now you've carry got carry double yeah. carryover. Yeah. So that means about how many percent? 33, more than 33 yeah. percent. Yes. Uh, till yesterday, there were only 24 expedition permit for Everest. Okay. As uh, 200, yeah. 2014, yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I am expecting this season about 35. 35 teams. Yeah. Ronnie? I'm Jivan. Jivan. Hello Jivan. I'm Matt. I'm Jivan. Nice to meet you. I'm your friend. He's very good friend. You are the one who came on this. You are the one who came on this. You are the one who came on this. Just initial. 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 As you know that you are the leader of this team, Mr. Ronald Kevin. We wish you all the best and uh, all your success. Thank you. And a wonderful journey. Thank you. It's going to be. <laughs> On thank behalf of our department. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> That's it. It's official. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, thank, you. You. Uh, thank you. Best of luck. Thank you very much. <laughs> We wish best <laughs> success. I wish also. <laughs> okay, so uh, that was quick, a lot quicker than I thought it was going to be. Tonight is the briefing, the official briefing. I just stopped off at uh, the grocery store, picked up uh, Matt some sweets. He loves his sweets and anything to make him feel a little bit more comfortable is a good thing. Now, I'm headed to NCEL Hi. to check out uh, getting some data on my phone for Everest. Apparently they have some good rates. That way, when I'm walking and trekking through to BC for 12 days, I'll be able to sync my phone up with my computer and uh, continue to upload some cool stuff. I am the proud owner of 10 gigabytes of NCEL 3G service. 10 gigabytes, that's a, if I try and keep my videos somewhat short, that's 20 videos and pictures and Facebook and whatever else. Uh oh, poor baby. <laughs> I came, just came back, gave him some, some, some of the food I just got. And he's no worse for wear. He's what is it? it is worse for wear, right? You are worse for wear. Mm -hmm. How's that saying go? 
So he's gonna take his temperature. Hopefully it's coming down, but he's pretty, pretty bad shape. You only got two days left, man. Okay. We're at 100.3. All right. Down. Yeah, yeah. 1029 of 100.3. That's good. So it's really unfortunate that Matt is so uh, out of shape. He. He hasn't been able to experience Nepal in any way like he really wanted to. And even that uh, tattoo convention, which he was so excited about, I don't think he's going to be up for it. All right, I've just bought my last piece of gear. Some wind-stopping pants and some super comfortable lightweight shorts. It's done. Now it's all about climbing. Excited now. I just got back from walking around. Matt's back up to 102. Is it 102 or 102.9? No, it was like 101. It was like 101.9. Oh, okay. So at least it's not 102, the highest. Poor Matt. You walk into the shower and it's like hot water. Oh, it's, it's fabulous. We have showers at base camp. Yep. When we took the trekking crew, I think we had seven or eight showers in an afternoon. Oh, man. Hot water. It was <laughs> ecstasy. <laughs> That's a good thing. So when you're getting dressed, you're really showers at base camp. That's awesome. Uh, I was not expecting to have showers at base camp. Hey, Kevin. This is a bunch of dodgy looking characters. How are you, Ryan? Good. Awesome. Nice to see you. How are you? <laughs> Because <laughs> it looks cooler. Oh, oh cool. <laughs> Free stuff. Gotta love it. Just keep.